Hey, what's up YouTube family? Back for another video. And today, there's always a constant struggle. Uh, something I've, I've, I've been working on for a while. And that is getting some kind of window curtains for my rig. And the shuttle buses have a curved wall. The wall is at farther in than it is down there. And so it curves. So if I was to hang a regular curtain it's going to stick out at the bottom. So I needed to find something, no matter what I did, if I put it here, it's still going to come out to the outside of the window sill. I want it to go flat in. So I had some curtains sewn, and I, I didn't go with the, the normal curtain rod, but I got this idea by Dorit, and a young lady, when she did it on one of her videos, I'm going to leave a link to her channel and that video in the description y'all go check her out she's doing some great things uh pretty much by herself uh, as a solo uh young female woman doing uh doing this uh bus life so let's get on with the video i had these curtains sewn with the uh fabric from walmart the sun zero zero blackout curtains anyway so uh, it's black on the outside Maroon on the inside, which I want, kind of goes with my interior. So, when I put it against the window, uh, it'll block out uh, a majority of the light. These, this stuff is really slick and uh, will work out well. Sorry about the, uh, during this video, my rig's a total mess. We're under construction here, alright? Anyway, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use some snaps. I'm going to screw some snaps to the windowsill up here. And then put the other end on the corner of the curtain, and I'll be able to snap them right here close to the glass. And then when they fall down, as heavy as this fabric is, that it's going to lay right here. And and if they want to come out anymore, it's easy. I'm just going to put a couple snaps down there on the bottom, and uh, I'll hold it down, and we're going to be good. Uh, all these curtains have been cut and sewn to fit, and. They're going to stretch a little bit, but let's get on with this. Let's show you what I'm going to do. Okay, so I don't want to mess up my countertops. I picked up this wood block uh, from around the place here. And I've got this little uh, snap kit from Amazon. And I'll show you a close-up. It comes with one part has the screw ends where you can screw them into the wood uh, siding. Then it's got the female part of the snap, and then the male part. And it comes with this little tool right here to put them onto the fabric. Now, I did buy a pair of these pliers for $20-something dollars on Amazon. It's supposed to make it easier, but I really, I really couldn't figure them out. So... Hey, let's show you how easy this is. I got my curtain right here. And we're going to pick the top of the window. I'm going to go in the corner first. I'm going to put my little insert down. And there's a, there's a pointy side and then this side, the flat side. I'm going to use this flat side here. bottom. Alright, we'll put the bottom on there. Alright, we're going to put this piece here down there first. We're going to position the fabric over where we want that snap to be. Then we're going to take the little female part and find that little nipple on there And then, let me show you a close-up. So, as you can see, as you can see, I've got the base there. 
then I've got the male side of the snap and then I got the female side alright and I'm gonna put that find the center of that male <laughs> stick my little tool in there grab the old trusty hammer give it a few good whacks and as you can see it's cut through the fabric and is rolled over and attached itself to the female end. I've got a good, nice, pretty snap right there. We're going to continue doing this uh, along the top edge uh, about five times. I'm going to do it about five times and uh, put five snaps on there. That way it gives it good close to the top and doesn't drape. So uh, I know it's going to stretch some too as well in the future. So let me show you. I've already got one done and I'll show you how that worked out. Alright, what I did here is I just took my drill, Phillips head bit, and drilled it into the wood where I wanted it. And then I got the snaps on the curtain, snap it right there, <laughs> and we're good to go. Then I can just pull them off as I need to. Uh, I want to pull off one corner and uh, get a little bit of light in there. Great. So, but yeah, it's gonna. When I get done here, it's gonna be uh, nice and stay. The head, the fabric is heavy enough that it's it doesn't fall out too bad. And I'm gonna leave it like that. If they start falling out away from the bottom, uh, I'll just add a couple snaps down here on the windowsill. So, anyway, I hope this was useful to you. And maybe it's an idea that you can do to put some window covers in your rig. I believe this will be uh, block out a lot of sun and a little bit of the weather. And we're all good. So anyway, thank you for watching. And I hope you learned something today. And we'll see you next time. This is the Free Rain Nomad. And you never know what's going to happen next.